In this video, we'll see a simple and efficient nogi takedown, the Russian tie to single leg. This is taken from a seminar taught by multiple time nogi world champ Javier Gomez, founder of JG Academy in the Bay Area. We'll see him both teach the technique and correct students as they drill it. For a full free playlist of all the techniques in the full seminar, check the description below. And stick around to the end to see a common defensive reaction to this single leg takedown setup. Let's get into it. Let him call it tight on the inside. I'm gonna take my free hand, doesn't matter which side it is, cup the wrist. Now I'm gonna shrug. I can't just pull the wrist because obviously they're doing a strong collar tight, and so I can't just pull it off. I'm gonna shrug, pull. My uh, left hand that had the collar tight is gonna go over hook and put some weight on my partner. So we're gonna get here. From here, I have the lead leg, okay? And we're gonna do two different setups to finish the takedown. From the lead leg, I'm gonna reach with the, uh, my left hand, hook, and grab and pull to the outside. Okay, so one more time and then we'll finish the takedown. So we're tied up, collar tie, open, over hook. Make sure you put weight on them, okay? But if you're just like this, you can just pull it with this hand. So, as soon as you get here, you're gonna put some weight on them. Left hand, which is for the single. I'm not gonna go traditional single where it goes between my legs. I'm already parallel to them, so I'm just gonna grab the single and take it to the other side. Okay? We have two ways to finish it. Uh, well, there's multiple ways, but two ways that I like to do. I can just lift, kind of run, and take them down, or switch from uh, my left hand to the back of the waist, Foot trip. Okay. Time. Again, you can just switch over, lift and throw your partner. So keep the single, lead hand back to the waist, stay nice and tight to your partner, and foot trip. And again, back to the waist, trip. So right there, I'll go back to okay. So go ahead and inside the collar tie. So let them tie up with you. And you take this hand and inside collar tie. So go around, inside. So we're gonna let him be on the outside. Oh, oh no, I'm sorry, I messed up. <laughs> <laughs> the other way around. And then you have to drive right here. Bring it over and under. And just use your shoulder press again. Oh, that way this hand is a free access to that. Okay. Yeah. Front leg. Grab the leg, lift them up. That's okay, there you go. Switch that. Yeah, you can either run them off the mat or like a chance. Yeah. 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 Here. For the actual takedown, um, do I want to like spin back a little bit? Yeah, I kind of turn them a little bit and that's where that foot trick comes in. Okay, so yeah, I'm you don't want to like drive them because then there's knees kind of in So, I'm just going to go ahead and take the single. So when I'm here, I'm going to use this hook to kind of open them up a little bit. Uh -huh. And I'm using my front foot to finish the sweep. Oh, so that way you end up more on your side. Because if you drive them forward, so you end up here, you end up more on the guard. Okay. Now that we've seen the basic entry for the single leg, here's what happens when the opponent frames your head or neck and you can't enter into the takedown. For the full breakdown, check out this next video in the playlist to see how to handle this defensive reaction. Thanks for watching.